Dreams didn't make us kings. Dragons did. The idea we control the dragons is an illusion. We'll proceed no further in this business. And I thought my opinion of you couldn't get any lower. Do not forget who put the crown on your childish head. Quit my sight. We'll just have to wait and see, won't we? I've learned to be patient. I'm afraid the Queen has charged me with seeing to it that you cause no further disturbance. Now that brings me pleasure, the thought of you pining away from me. You had your chance. And you made your choice. It wasn't my choice. <laughs> Is that how you justify cruelty? <laughs> Games of men exhaust me. My daughter, she's no longer mine. What do you mean? always respected you like a second father. I lost her. You swore an oath to my father to protect me. I do what I must. Then I would rather die with a heart that is whole than live with one broken by cowardice. Forsaking family and love. I don't blame you. You do not belong in this place. A fool's bit. And now for as long as you live, you have a sword dangling over your head. It is hardly mercy to ask a man to set his integrity aflame. Sit on your golden throne and watch this battle from the safety I provide you, my king. What cowardice have I ever shown to make you think I would even consider making safe my own skin at the peril of yours? I'm a loyal servant. There's no such thing. Now for you a chance to avoid such misery and join me. And there are no words left for us to speak. Father. My king. I know you are this kingdom's true heir. I have almost forgot the taste of fears. We have scorched the snake, not killed him. Yet at every turn I made the choices I did.